Hey guys, Frost here. Welcome back. Today we're going to talk about Burning Crusade as well as the future of classic servers moving on to 2021. Now recently Blizzard sent another survey to a select number of players asking them questions about the potential fresh classic servers, Burning Crusade and so on. Um, for me at this point Burning Crusade it's not a matter of if, it's just a matter of when but we'll get into this later. Uh, this survey, um, which has been sent to a select number of players, if you're one of them, congratulations. If not, why not feel one yourself? As I stumbled across a video made by Numidia, which, uh, in which he's sharing um, a poll with all the questions that were asked in those survey. You can fill it out yourself. His goal is to reach uh, as many people as possible to eventually reach Blizzard so we can eventually get a potential Burning Crusade. So it's just a way to share it forward. If you want to fill it, it's going to be a link in the description. So let's get right into it. However, before you fill the survey, you can put pause here so your answers won't be in somehow influenced by my answers or other people's answers. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So the first question was uh, how interested are you in a classic version of Burning Crusade? 71.7% uh, of people asked uh, extremely interest while 15% asked uh, very interested. Keep in mind that this survey was not sent only to classic players but to a variety of people using the Battle.net account. So we got a potential and there's also a big chunk of moderately interested. So 87%, maybe 90% are interested in TBC. This is very good, considering the fact that this was not sent only to classic player. And not at all interest was only a 2.4%, so a very small margin. But keep in mind that this is um, a sample of 3468 responses. After we fill uh, this one, maybe we can uh, get a better number. So please make sure you fill this one too. The second question goes to how likely are you to play a classic version of TBC? Which is uh, kind of the same question. And the answer here, weirdly enough, goes uh, to 81% to very likely and 11.5% to somewhat likely. Um, yet again, a small margin... Uh, of people that are very unlikely to play classic TBC. Now, based on those two questions, they don't feel to me like questions of if they actually want the... It's more like a rhetorical question. Um, I'm not even sure if I should put it this way. It feels to me like th those two first two questions are formulated in a way like uh, this. So guys, we already have Burning Crusade, worked 80% of it or halfway through. We've been working since last year. You guys want to play it? It's like a reassuring, it's a reconfirming, trying to see if they did a mistake or not. Uh, I'm pretty sure they've been working on this for a long period of time and that now they're just trying to reassure. Moving on to the next question, which is a bit more complicated. If World of Warcraft introduced a new WoW Classic fresh start, you know, like private servers, fresh uh, realm, where the game is as it was on day one, all players to level one, Molten Core and Onyxia, all the raids available, Battlegrounds and yet basically it's like exactly like we had the, the start back in uh, August of uh, 2019, would you play it? And this is uh, a bit mixed here, there's uh, a 25% almost not at all interested and I can understand why maybe people don't want to go through phase two again. Um, there are many questions about this but it does seem that a big part of the community is very interested. Now you have to understand that the people who filled those responses right now and the people that will feel from watching this video, they're, they're people that played Classic until now. They're big fans of Classic. So it's normal to see about a 20% of very interested and about a 20% of somehow interested out of uh, 3,500 uh, uh, votes. This is like 1.3k votes uh, The people would be interested. Uh, based on uh, those answers here, we don't know yet the answers that uh, were sent to the survey on Blizzard. This is like something outside of that. That's why we need to feel that if you want to play a classic server fresh start, 
with Burning Crusade or without Burning Crusade, make sure you fill this one. Maybe it actually gets to Blizzard like Numidia says. Moving on, thinking about your main WoW Classic character, would the character you create on this new fresh start round become your new main character? Or would you play this in addition to the main character? Which, um, there's only two responses here. The character on the new fresh start while classic would become my new main character which is 33 percent of the people asking but this is weird because uh based on the other responses here it doesn't make sense so they're really limited the answers and 67 percent said that i would play the character on the fresh start in addition to my main character and they don't have an option here where you can say uh, no thanks or there's it's, it's a weird survey, basically. And uh, the last question, where do you think you would spend more of your time? A new fresh uh, classic server, where we start from day one. That was a 10% uh, out of uh, 3,400 votes. 81% uh, would be on the Burning Crusade classic, which kind of goes hand in hand with um, the answer here. Like 81% voted that uh, they very likely want to play Burning Crusade and here it's the same 81.1% basically like two votes away they would uh, spend more most of the time their main would be in Burning Crusade and I think that would be similar for me I think that's what I voted as well and then we go another 9% uh, uh, say that they would play both equally but yet again we don't have enough answers maybe some people would say I would play a bit of fresh classic and then most of the time on uh, Burning Crusade. This is a, it's only either fresh, either or equal. Okay, so uh, we got some nice responses here. Uh, I'm really curious to see after a couple of days uh, after this video being up, how many more answers we can get. And I'm really curious if this will reach Blizzard. And I really want it to reach Blizzard because uh, we do want Burning Crusade, at least I do. And I'm pretty sure most of the people watching this channel want uh, make sure to share it with friends that play classic world of warcraft and uh, now to give a, a couple of uh, scenarios on how i think burning crusade will be released now uh, i might not agree with them it's just uh, how i see it now i think all the servers from uh, classic world of warcraft will upgrade to burning crusade and uh, then we'll get a fresh server for every region or even two if there's demand uh, some of uh, some of us will have options to copy our characters to a new classic server and all of the rest of the servers will go to TBC. Now, why do I think this? I think this is the least amount of uh, work that Blizzard has to do. It's the path of least resistance. Now, there were many players that uh, asked me like Frost, how about the server names? Don't we have server names with Illidan? Won't we have server names with Macteridan? Uh, Whatever, we already had Macteridon in Vanilla, but that's not the point. Uh, that's how I think it will happen. Um, when do I think we'll get news about this being officially? I think it's going to be February at BlizzCon. We're going to get an official announcement, probably a whole panel about Burning Crusade Classic and the old Classic servers. Uh, when do I think we're going to see a beta based on some rumors? I think we're going to see it uh, late March, early April. And when will we see a Burning Crusade release uh, official? Probably during summer of 2020, either early or late, depending if they release anything with uh, Shadowlands and so on, a new patch or something. Now, one of the reasons why I think Blizzard released Naxxramas in early December, shortly after uh, Shadowlands, which they don't usually do, one of the reason it's because they plan an early release to Burning Crusade. Um, that's it. That's pretty much my theory. And um, I hope it's true. I hope we get Burning Crusade fast. I just finished clearing Nexramas. I know I made a video a few days complaining about my guild disbanding, but I found a new guild. We progressed to Saffiron, we progressed to Kel'Zuzad. I got the first uh, Soul Seeker stuff drop. I know it's uh, not the best option, but it's an underrated stuff. We're gonna talk about this in a different video. Thank you very much for watching. And again, a shout out to Numidia for uh, putting this uh, drop pool out there. And hope you vote, hope this reaches Blizzard. And thank you very much for watching. Until next time, stay frosty.